Hey guys, this is just going to be like a quick video, a quick four minute video on the uh, R3T20. I had a couple games and I was messing around with Shadow Play to try and get like, because it only records the last five minutes for me right now. So I've been setting it up properly now. Um, but I miss like audio wise, like I was talking to someone on Discord, I had the um, music on. So I just cut out all the audio and put in a game soundtrack from um, FTL, which I really like. Yeah, so I was messing around with my squad mate and uh, we decided to take out the R3s because, you know, it's stupidly OP. Um, we got full down tier. And I just feel sorry for these guys, because these are like 2.7 players. You know, these are fairly new players, most of them. And I'm just bringing out this auto cannon, supercar, fucking Lightning McQueen piece of shit that should be way, way higher BR. And I just feel bad sometimes. <laughs> but yeah, so uh, I'm just vibing in the R3. Full artillery on three guys. There's a B1 bis, I think a Crusader, and maybe a Matilda. I don't right, remember. The B1 dies, and that's the only thing I was really worried about at the time. Obviously, Matilda is also very scary. I think it was Matilda. Matilda or Valentine. I don't know. British tank. It had armor. Ran my teammate. We just go in for it. Start spraying at all of the shells that I'm seeing. Not doing anything because bit of a distance, so not gonna kill anyone. Track that. Uh, I think it's a Crusader? Not quite sure. But yeah, so, um... We're just, like, in this corner, poking in and out, spraying our lips down at them, and absolutely decimating. Obviously, I get him through the turret there, which is quite nice. Crusader. And then I get him as well. Another Crusader, and it's just, like... These guys shouldn't be facing this thing. This is, like, a post-Cold... Like, a, not post-Cold War, but, like, mid-Cold War vehicle. With a fully stabilized 20 mil, it can go insanely fast, it can flank anything. Like, why is it at the BR it is? <laughs> it took me a second to notice that M3, and that <laughs> it's pretty dumb. But yeah, so, I get him pretty easily. There's a, the guy that killed my teammate, I see him as well. Just, like, the fact that I can do that to tanks at this BR, to players who've, like, just started playing, is ridiculous. So I died quickly after that. Okay, the JU-87 completely fluffed up my bomb, because I've not played the game in a couple days, searching for flats and stuff. Zoom back over, do the same flanky thing because our team's kind of got the rest of it on lockdown. Using my um, squad mate to like get call outs for where the enemies are. Gets a sick double kill with the bombs. And uh, yeah, start to climb the hill, going after the enemies. Don't see anything yet. I notice the trees just falling over because there's people firing back and forth there. But yeah, as you can see, we're absolutely annihilating this game. So I decide to. Um, like start rushing towards their spawn. Obviously I'm not spawn rushing yet. Like I'd say this is a spawn push rather than a spawn camp. Because like we've got all the points and we've got most of the map. So the only logical place to push to is their spawn. Which is it does feel kinda bad when you do that. But this game is almost over anyways and I I was kinda done for the day gaming. So because I've just been like doing so much shit outside. It was fucking dead. But yeah, so, um, here's, I see another guy coming out of their spawn. I feel really bad about that kill. You know, he's, he's probably just spawned in, getting ready to move into the battlefield. And here's where I probably do something that I shouldn't have. I first try and, like, go over to the middle so I can, like, fight them as they're coming out of spawn, but that doesn't work. So I just charge straight into their spawn to see how many people I'm going to run into. <laughs> this is just another reason why this fucking thing shouldn't be at this BR. Like, look at that. That guy, he's he's barely spawned. Another guy starts praying at this guy. Now, something interesting happens here with this guy's turret. Like, it starts jumping all over the place. And I don't think my ping was that high. So I don't know why it was doing that. Like, look at that. It just, like, jumped forward. Um, Yeah, I missed the first couple shots because, you know, I'm firing sideways with a really high velocity thing. You know, there's a lot of momentum coming out of that. I don't know how that M M16 died instantly. And I start firing at a guy with spawn protection so it does nothing, and that's that's the double ace. Uh, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys around.